Do you want to join tables together to accommodate larger parties? Res Diaries Table Joins tool will let you add table joins to your venue so that they can be booked automatically. Table joins will only be used after any natural table of that capacity has been booked. This tutorial will show you how to plan out your table joins, add new table joins, edit existing table joins and add table joins on the fly. Before you begin to add your table joins, you need to know which tables will join and in how many different configurations. You should aim to add all the combinations in your venue so that your diary will always be able to find space for your guests. You'll know which tables you would commonly join in your venue. Know these down and consider whether there are any further joins you would like to add. Once you have planned out all your table joins, you are ready to add them to your diary. To do this, from your diary click settings and from the table management section click table joins. If you have multiple segments enabled, you will need to select the one you will be making changes to. This opens the table joins menu. At the top there are selected tables, capacity and the add new chain button where you can build and add new table joins. If you already have table joins in place, below this your joins will be displayed in a table. You will be able to filter by capacity by clicking the numbered boxes. In the table chain, the capacity of the join tables and icons for deleting and editing the chain will be shown. To create a new table join, click on the Select Tables drop down to pick from the list of tables or type in the table number and hit return for it to be selected. Add all the tables that will make up this chain. You can now set the maximum number of guests that can be sat at this table chain. This may be larger than the sum total of the table's capacity as you may be able to make room for additional covers. You cannot add the same table join more than once with different capacities, so you need to set it to its maximum capacity. Once happy, click the Add New Chain button to save your new join. To edit an existing table join, find the table chain from the list and click the Edit button. From here, you are able to change the capacity of this table. However, you cannot change the tables that make up the chain and you would have to delete the chain with the trash icon and add a new one with the tools above. You are able to change the rankings of these joins by dragging and dropping the rows into a new order and clicking Save Order. You are also able to create table joins on the fly in the diary. When making a booking in your diary, you can click the link icon in the booking menu to bring up the table join pop-up. You will be able to set whether this is a permanent join, which will save the join so that it is bookable in the future, or temporary, which means it will only be available for this booking. You can then select the tables you wish to join and set the capacity. Once finished, click the Add Join button. If you're having any issues or have any questions, you can find more information about table joins on the knowledge base or get support anytime by raising a ticket.